So before this tutorial even begins, I want to point out something that I didn't notice until after I had recorded the tutorial you're about to watch. But this tutorial is about LUTs and color grading, and after recording the video, I realized that Final Cut may have updated afterwards or since then, but Apple provides a way to add a custom LUT under the effects browser under color and then you have a custom LUT of which you can drag onto your footage. And then from there, you can load a custom LUT, but you have to do it one at a time. Whereas in the plugin I'm about to show you, you can see the colors and see multiple at once. So yeah, let's get on with the tutorial now. Hello and welcome back to another tutorial. In today's video, I'm going to show you how you can further color grade your footage in Final Cut Pro using LUTs. Let's go ahead and get started. The plugin I use, there are many out there, but the one I like of the ones I found can be found at motionvfx.com. Unfortunately, to get this plugin, you will need to create a account. You will not need to pay anything, but you will need to create a account and download the M installer. Once you have that installed and after you've created a account, you will then be able to add this to your cart. Then you'll quote unquote purchase. So you will need a debit card, even though it's charging you nothing. Then once you've down downloaded the M installer, which looks a little bit like this, then you'll be able to install your plugin from here. Then once that's installed, you will be able to open up Final Cut Pro. Then you'll find your plugin in the effects browser. Now, in regards to LUTs, there are many that you can find out there online. There's some from Premium Beat. They have a lot of uh, free downloads, which by the way, this is not a sponsored video. These are just LUTs that I've found online for free or some that I've paid for that I myself use. FCPXfree.com also has a bunch, and I've also purchased some from Peter McKinnon. To use the MLUT plugin, you will come over to the FX browser. You will scroll down to MLUT. You will click on this and drag it right on top of the video clip. From there, you'll select MLUT library. Now, I do believe they have some preloaded in there, but I also have my variety of LUTs that I have downloaded. So you'll click MLUT library, and then you can find all your LUTs that you have installed or organized. So I'm going to use a teal and orange. Uh, I'm just gonna find one that looks good. Then you can click OK. So as you can see, it has changed the tone of the video clip. And then we can look at it before and after. So it makes this video clip a little bit darker, which is maybe not what we want. But we can also change the intensity. So if we wanted to go somewhere in the middle, that way it looks a little bit more interesting. But when I actually go to edit this tutorial, I'll, I will have to be very nitpicky about each thing or just ignore the fact that parts get darker. Oh, well. But that is how you can easily color grade your footage even further. And again, you can like change the highlights and mid tones. So that is how you can further color grade your footage in Final Cut Pro. If there's anything else you'd like to know about editing in Final Cut Pro that you would like to see me make a tutorial on, let me know in the comments below. So anyways, thank you guys so much for watching. If you enjoyed this video, you can give it a big thumbs up. You can click right over here to subscribe to their respective channels. And you can click right over here to see my previous video. And as always, I'll see you in the next tutorial. Bye-bye.